Hello everyone again and welcome to my channel. In here, this is actually our final video of a series of reactions which ranges from circular addition reactions to electrocyclic reactions and finally sigmotropic rearrangement and all those have actually helped us to see some beautiful interesting chemistries happening either within a chemical ring or along a chain of conjugated systems. Now, in this particular reaction that happens in our body, we see the th th synthesis of vitamin D from cholesterol. So in here we have a cholesterol compound and it's been transformed into vitamin D. Just by the fact that these particular compounds here, they're kind of similar, but there's an interesting difference in here. And that is actually triggered thermally and there are two things you have to take note of which reaction will actually be favored first of all if you're going from right of this compound to the left we see here that oh there is a one two three so we should expect possibly a one three hydrogen shift but that's not the case as you look at in this particular product in here reason is because this ring is kind of really rigid and it's kind of hard for we to actually position the hydrogen here in such a way that it will actually enter officially from a sigma bond on carbon 3 in here by space movement or migration so since that is not allowed in this particular reaction then we kind of proceed further down going from right to left and what we see is that oi we actually do have something quite different here we do have an interesting change in here where on one side we have a unsaturated carbon being a saturated carbon in here and on this other side we have a saturated carbon becoming an unsaturated carbon so we're like uh-huh maybe we do have something quite interesting going on here let's number around this particular system going from this saturated to the unsaturated one going from left to right so we number this as one two three four five six seven ah ha ah. so we do have something interesting here we do have a one seven hydrogen shift because what we see here is our hydrogen actually moving or migrating until officially to this particular bond in here our carbon in here and what happens next is that we are having a electrocyclic process where as that is being moved this bond forms a pi bond in here and then this bond forms a pi bond in here and this bond over here forms a pi bond in here so this reveals that oh we do have a one seven sigma tropic shift of a hydrogen atom that leads to the formation of our product in there now also you need to realize that this is actually spontaneously occurring without any light so in this case this is actually an anterofacial migration of our hydrogen atom if we look at it at the molecular orbital level so on our previous video we focus more on how that actually takes place you can just go back to that video to understand more of the orbital description of a one seven hydrogen shift and that will actually make you to actually apply that into this particular reaction however if you're looking at the other case where it's actually done in a photochemical way then it means that in a photochemical sense we are actually going in a reverse direction so if i'm going from this back to here what is happening now is that okay since our hydrogen is here to go in a reverse direction then it must actually be favored in a superficial one seven hydrogen shift in a photo chemical reaction going from vitamin D back into cholesterol while on this particular side here we 
are actually going in the forward direction in the presence of heat. So that is kind of an interesting way to actually differentiate when we have a reaction that's occurring thermally going from left to right and photochemically going from right to left in our body where we look at the synthesis of either vitamin D from cholesterol or synthesis of cholesterol from vitamin D. All the same, thanks for following me through this trailer. Really appreciate it. Hit the comment down below. Let me hear your thoughts. Hit the like, share, and subscribe. And see you all on my next video. Peace, love you all, and be smart.